Hey y'all, it's Myra. So today I'm going to be doing a review for West Kiss Hair. This is what their box looks like. They sent me a 24 inch, 180 density HD frontal unit. So I'm just going to be showing you guys what they give you in the box other than the wig. Because I already customized it. So first off, they give you a bonnet. They give you a West Kiss bonnet, which is so cute. I think that is so cute. Like, you can never have too many bonnets because I lose my bonnets. I don't know about y'all, but I lose mine all the time. So, yeah, they give you a bonnet. Then they give you this, which is like a scarf, but it's... um velvet and it has like this crown on there which is so freaking cute this is so cute like what then they give you this large scarf but you can wear it different ways uh, you can just use it to tie your edges down you can actually wear it with an outfit they give you this large scarf, which is so cute. You know, if you want to do the whole, like, Instagram baddie, like, you know, you know. So, yeah. They give you that. They give you an elastic band to make your wig glueless, if you'd like. They give you more than enough, which I appreciate because, like, you just never know how much you'll need depending on your head circumference. So, they give you a pretty long one. They give you some wig caps. These are a bit light, you know, but it was thoughtful. It's the thought that counts. These are cute, you know. Gonna have to put a lot of makeup on them. And Christmas is over, but they send you a Christmas card, and it says West Kiss on the back, and it says West Kiss Hair. Wish you have a best Christmas ever. How cute, right? <laughs> so yeah. And they give you a bag to store your unit in, which I love. Y'all know I love when they provide the bags. So, let's get into the hair. I already took the hair out because, like I said, I, I already customized it. But they send it in this bag. But what I like about the bag is they have all the specs right here. It says 24 inch cap size medium hair density 180. So yeah. So I got a 24 inch body wave unit. I did not bleach the knots. I just wanted to do it after I washed the hair because I wanted to wear the body wave pattern. And I don't know how it'll look after I wash it. So I just wanted to just wear it for a little bit and then when I wash the hair, then I'll go in and bleach the knots. But I did some light plucking on the sides and stuff like that. Let me show you. Nothing crazy, just a little bit. So I'm going to be installing this like all the way through with ghost bond and everything. As y'all can see, I already did my bald cap. I did a fresh one. So yeah. So first thing that I like to do is basically put on the wig but not put on the wig if that makes sense so so i put the clip in in the back and then i push the wig back like this i just comb the hairs back so they don't get in the way As for the quality of the hair, this hair is super soft and thick. It's 180 density, but it really feels like 200. I know that's only 20% more, but the hair is super, super thick and long. Y'all know I love a long unit on me. It just flatters me a little bit more. So what you'll need is a hair dryer that has a cool setting and ghost bond. 
I already cleaned my perimeter with alcohol so it's nice and, and clean. And I'm just going to start installing this unit. If you want a more detailed tutorial, I will do that for you. But I'm trying to vlog today. So I'm trying to hurry up and do this so I can start getting ready for work. But yeah, I'm just using the regular Ghost Bond. Because every time I, I go, they're out of Ghost Bond Active. Y'all know that's the one that is waterproof. But I think I'm going to try the Isha Glue next time but what i do is i do middle side and then the other side so you just want to have all your stuff ready because that's what i'm bad about not having my stuff ready i'm just gonna go ahead and put the hair back because i just don't want any mess ups y'all because i'm gonna wear this for like a week Basically what you want to do is put dots along the the perimeter and then smooth it out. Right on top of your uh your cap. And then push it down so the cap is nice and flat too and it won't move around on you underneath the wig. That's what it used to do for me before I figured out that I needed to uh actually put the glue on the cap. So, you live and learn. So, as y'all can see, I just laid down the first section. I'm not going to do two to, most people do like two to three layers. I'm not going to do that. Um, I don't want it to be super difficult to take off. And I'm not a real huge sweater and I do wrap my hair every night. So, that's just not super necessary for me. So now what you want to do is, oh my gosh, I have glue everywhere. One thing about me is I suck at putting on like the glue and stuff. It goes everywhere. Some of it got in the hair just a little bit, but I tried to wipe it off before it got too tacky. So you just want to blow dry this until uh, it's clear and then you want to lay your wig down. If you're doing two layers, wait till it's clear, add another layer, spread it. Uh, and then wait till it's clear, then put your wig on. So that's how you do that. Okay, so as y'all can see, it's clear. This little piece right here, I don't know why that's not getting clear, but it's okay. Um, so now what you want to do is bring it forward and place it on the glue. And they say not to use your fingers. I use mine and I use the comb. But just do whatever you're comfortable with. This part is so tedious and like nerve wracking because you can really just mess it up, honestly, easily. Okay, that's not too bad.
Okay, here's the finished product. Uh, so far, what I noticed about this hair, no tangling whatsoever. Um, takes really well to the hot comb. It's not perfect, y'all. I'm sorry, but um, I'm kind of rushing. But the, the lace is HD. I really can't just notice it that well. And I didn't bleach to knots, so that's pretty good. Um, this is how long the hair is on me. That's how long I normally like my hair. Uh, I will be doing an update on this on this wig and stuff like that and telling y'all how it curls and all of that. But I kind of want to wear it in the body wave. Because I haven't worn like body wave like hair in so long. So, yeah. Thank you so much for watching. And thank you, West Kiss, for sponsoring this video. Thank you for sending me this beautiful unit. Make sure y'all go shop. This hair is really, really, really good. It's soft. It's flowy. No shedding, no tangling. I haven't got any shedding. Only shedding I got was me cutting the lace and plucking, but that's to be expected. Um, so, yeah. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you on my next one.